Alrighty, good evening everybody. How are we doing tonight? Great to see y'all here. El Waka X2, welcome. Great to see you in chat. Alright, hello, hello. Um, so today, um, I wanted to play, um, I, well, it's not a usual streaming day. I kind of miss Thursday's stream because of a work event. And so I thought I would do a bonus stream, but then I didn't want to do a Song of Nunu stream because I didn't want people like to miss out on it because it's a weird time for me to stream. I'm gonna get music credit up there. I'm also tossing them over. I'll just toss some Christmas emotes. There we go. Yeah, so I th was looking through my Steam library and I found this game called Sigil of the Magi. It looked like lots of fun. Um, I had a friend who um, who recommended it to me. It's a small indie game. It, it looked like loads of fun. I, I wanted to try it out. Um, so yes, yeah, so that's kind of going to be what we're doing today. It sort of like gives Slay the Spire sort of vibes to it. But yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. Um, what was I going to pull up? Oh yes, one other thing I'm super excited for. Um, next week on Thursday, in the Epic Game Store, there is a game called Predecessor. Here, let me pause the music. And it's going to be free. Um, here, let me see if I can oh, find a video of it. But yeah, it looks a lot like Smite, in which that, that's got me really interested in it. It's sort of like a sci-fi world. Okay, here, let me mute, okay, here, actually, I probably should mute that, just, I don't know if it's a DMCA risk, okay, uh, I can't find it, okay, but, essentially, yeah, you have, like, the three lanes and everything, it looks, like, fun, so I'm probably going to be playing that this Thursday, I'll do a predecessor stream, it looks like loads of fun. All right, here, before, without further ado, let me get the game up and running. Game capture, okay. Play. But yeah, hope y'all are doing well. Hope y'all are having a good weekend. Um, huh, it is not popping up. Capture specific window. There it is, Sigil the Magi. Uh, settings. Video, full screen, there we go. Awesome, let's play. Okay, party selection, Royal Vanguard. Often tasked to lead the charge in battle, the Royal Vanguard is an elite battalion that consists of the best soldiers in the entire kingdom of Valandris. Okay, Royal Vanguard. Okay, at the behest of the council, the king has ordered the court wizard to personally bring a small army with him to investigate the rumors regarding the tomb of Angua. <clears throat> okay, and so I've got a... Then I have... Wait. Okay, so this is the only one I have unlocked. Okay, Royal Vanguards it is. Difficulty... Yeah, it's just normal. Alright, let's see what this is. Okay, so this is like a standard roguelike. It looks like we got our map. This is the overworld map. Your goal is to get to the end and progress to the next stage. You can travel to any point on your current position, but cannot go backwards. Just want to make sure I unmute. Okay, good, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, let me see. I don't know what this is. I, I see a treasure chest here. Let me go towards the treasure chest. Okay, place your champions. Tutorial tip: You can get to you get to position your champions at the start of each battle. However, they can only be placed within the green zone. Okay. Oh, so I only get the knight right now. Okay. Oh, okay. So I get to place the knight. I'll place him here. Do the ranger there and the wizard there. Okay. Press start to begin the battle. Okay. Turn one. At the start of every turn, you will drive, draw five cards from your draw pile. This is your current hand. Okay. So is your draw pile, and you can click on it to check the remaining cards in the pile. Cards will not be displayed in the sequence. Okay. 
If at the start of the turn there are not enough cards left in the draw pile to draw from, all cards currently in the discard pile will be shuffled back into the draw pile. Okay, so it looks like I have three mana. I guess we'll give the knight the armor. Okay, so I can only... Okay, so gray stuff is played on the knight. Green stuff is the ranger. And the wizard. Okay, let's try to kill this guy. Okay. So far shot. Yeah, you got him. All right. Nice. And then, oh, that's perfect! Then he just slashes. Okay, once your mana is depleted, you won't be able to play any more non-zero cost cards. Press end turn if you're done making all your moves. Okay, cool. Let me just, this cost zero. Might as well get the armor. Um, yeah, I'll send the turn. Dang, okay. Spend mana to store cards in the card rack. Store cards will not go in the discard pile. However, cards cannot be played on the same turn they're stored. Okay. The card rack is fooled, and the rightmost card will be discarded into the discard pile when a new card is stored. You can learn more about an enemy by selecting it. Select this one here. The green tiles indicate the enemy's moveset range, and the red tiles show its attack range. Enemies are consistent and predictable. The skill that an enemy used on its turn will be shown here. Okay. Enemies follow a strict turn order. Use the blue button to check their ordering sequence. Okay. There's a typo there. Okay. Okay. Use it. Okay, inflict provoke. Okay, there we go. So now the dog will be forced to attack him. I guess we kill the dog. Oh, the internet's gonna love me. Oh, this is better. Yeah, gain eight armor. End turn. Ouch. Okay. Did not like that. I probably should have given her the armor in hindsight. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, this seems really complicated. I'm gonna move you here. I'm gonna do far shot. Okay, grant four armor to any unit occupying this tile at the end of the turn. Oh. Okay. Right, go there. Oh shoot, now it's out of range. Great gain eight armor. Can I move him again? Oh, that's out of mana. Okay. End turn. Dang, I have a lot of armor. Okay, he really likes attacking. Okay, slash him. Sure, gain the armor. Dang it, I keep moving too far. But look at, what do you got against rangers, dude? Okay, here we go, fine. You know what, shoot him. Oh, I have to actually back up.
Alright, he seems hellbent on destroying that ranger. What the heck, man? Okay. There you go. Wizard, take him out. Nice! Awesome. Okay, you get reward after winning a battle. Gold can be used to buy new cards and other services. Add a new card. Adds a new card to your deck from a random selection of three cards. Okay, so that's like Discover. Sweet. Okay. Okay, so I can always skip. Cool. Blood for power. Deal three damage to self to grant two power. Gain two armor for each card stored in your card rack. No, on guard. Seems really good. Okay, proceed. All right, to the treasure. 28 gold and trick dice. At the start of a combat, discard any number of cards, then draw that many. Okay, not gonna lie, that seems kind of nutty. That seems really good. Okay, forward in battle. Okay. So I want you here. Ranger, we're gonna want you there. And wizard, you're gonna... Okay, we're gonna have wizard and knight stick together. And ranger, you're gonna kind of be by yourself. Okay. I'm, wait, no, I want you there. All right, we start. Far shot. Select cards to discard. Um... You know what? I'm going to discard this one. Awesome. Okay, let's discard you. Okay. So we're going to do defensive aura. It's really good. out of range. Dang it. Okay, you know what? Just unguard. Nine more armor. Okay, this is pretty cool. I, I really like this game so far. All right. Wizard staff deals seven damage, but just out of range. Okay. Have you gained some armor? I'm oh, just out of range. Okay. Knight, you gained some armor. Okay, the wizard definitely seems more mid range. Okay. Oh my gosh. Armor, draw a card. Hopefully. Okay, I'm. Okay. okay. We're gonna slash that guy. Okay, I need to take out some of these weaker guys. Focusing on the big guy at first wasn't a smart idea. He's given all his guys armor. This is hard so far. Okay. okay six damage. That's pretty good. We won't give you six armor. There we go. Gain some armor, pal. Q. 
Yikes, that's a lot of damage. Let me see here. Sure, gain some armor, so why not? Have you gain some armor and I'm gonna pull the wizard back to the bush because he'll gain armor in the bush if the archer hasn't moved during her turn increase base damage by 50% that's really good here. 7 damage, 7 damage, so 10 damage. I want to do that. You can almost take out this guy. Alright. Okay, my party is losing health quickly. Oh my gosh, and they just heal and deal that much damage? Oh goodness. Okay. Sure, gain five armor. Guess gain the armor. Come on, you need to die. Okay, we've almost got the one guy taken out. All right. Slash. Okay, there we go. Shoot 10 damage. Oh, he actually moved my guy. All right, far shot. Eight damage. All right, let's move the knight forward and slash. Okay, that defeats this guy. Okay. Shoot, I should have moved the knight over here. You know what? Let's. Okay, we're gonna minimize our damages. Man, this is taking a long time, this encounter. Okay, far shot, deal two. Mm. Okay, and then the knight, we're gonna have you move forward. You have a big old slash, okay. You know what? Deal 10 damage is pretty good. Deal 10 damage is pretty good. Either way, it's 7 damage. Okay, I'm gonna be real. Like, how am I supposed to beat this guy? here. We gain some armor. Gosh. Can I move you any farther? Okay. That's fine. Okay. Brownie man, hello. How's it going? 
I'm trying out this game. Uh, I had a friend recommend it to me. It's called um, called Sigil of the Magi. It's like a deck building, like um, Slay the Spire, but then you also have guys you move around the board. It's pretty cool so far, except it's really hard. Like I'm losing a lot of health really quickly. I just need to damage this guy. Let's move the knight forward. Knight slash wizard. You go here. Wizard staff. End turn. Oh. Are you a big fan of this game? It's the first time you played it? Or like, I, I mean, is this the first time you've seen someone play it? Are you familiar at all? Gain some armor. Nah, hadn't heard of it. That's okay. Honestly, it's a pretty niche indie game from what I've seen. I mean, it's fun, but it's like, dang, it's hard. Like, we're slowly whittling away this guy's health. You know what? I'm just gonna... Let's have everybody gain some armor. Honestly, we kind of need it. But no, it's a fun game. I think I got it for like 15-ish bucks on Steam. It's pretty good. Um, right, let's shoot. Oh, 20 armor, my goodness. He's just able to... Like, we are hacking away at this guy. But he is still... Oh. He's almost killed my wizard. Oh my gosh. Okay. Right, 10 damage. 7 damage. Just like that, like he's healing 22. Okay, I need to move the wizard back as far as I can. Because otherwise, if he gets a shot in... Can you see their move pool intense? Yeah. Here it is right now. Like, I can see that, okay, the next time this guy attacks, he's going to do a basic ranged attack, which deals 19 damage. If he hits the wizard with that, um, I'm dead. Or he's dead. Actually, what I should do, move the wizard into a bush. At least that's a little protection. Six damage. Slash. And turn. Yikes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Gain some armor. Oh, goodness. Nine damage. Okay, what's he going to do next? 24 armor. My gosh. Okay. I don't think I can get the wizard within range. Let's see if I draw a card. Draw something good. Magic armor. Okay. Actually. Have you grant her some armor? Okay. It's like he's healing for 24 every turn. My goodness. Okay. I'm gonna need to move the wizard out. Okay, next turn he's just healing more. Okay, I'm going to... Far shot. You to slash, and then I'm gonna need you to shoot again. Goodness. 
What's he doing next? 21 damage. Slash. Shoot. Okay, I need you to run into that bush. I need you to run into the other bush. And we end our turn. Okay, there goes my ranger. Um... How am I supposed to beat this guy? My numbers are just so low. Is this game like Fire Emblems plus Slay the Spire? Yeah, that's sort of my impression of it. Three Flax. And by the way, hey, welcome to the stream. It's great to see you, Three Flax. Rip. Yeah. Oh, man. Rip my ranger. Or my archer, I think is what she's called. Like, I just don't have enough damage output to kill this guy. Reminds you of Floppy Knights? I can't say I've heard of that one. Okay, you know... Uh, what's his... Okay, is there a way for me to surrender? Abandon run. Or you know what? No, I'll play it to the end. Oh, gosh. Really? He chose to... Okay. I have a little bit of time. Still out of range. Okay, slash. Defend. Slash. Okay. The fact that he's able to just get... 28 armor is insane. Slash. I guess his armor is good. Yeah, 24 armor. Oh my gosh. I don't understand anything, but I think you're losing. Elwaka, you're not far off. I am I am losing. This game has gone on so long the music stopped. Okay, now it's going again. Okay, well, I've got three actions to do. Yikes. 30 armor. My... Does this scale? Oh, is it just because it's gaining two power every... Oh... So I needed to kill this guy early, is what I'm learning. Oh my god. Eventually he's just gonna kill me. I don't think I can beat him anymore. Yeah. I don't think so either. Did I ever really have a shot of beating him in the first... Uh, I guess... Because I focused on the little guys that were easy to defeat. So in hindsight, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, he's just too big. Bro's been farming stats since the start. <laughs> yeah, he really has been. Oh my goodness. I'll, I mean, I'll, I'll play it to the end. But I, I've lost, I know. Yeah, there you go. All dead. Defeat. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dang. All right. Okay, let's try this again. Um, okay. I want to go to treasure chest. Treasure chest looks fun. Okay, so just it's um bandit and two dogs. Okay, 
right, let's start. This looks like a good position. Okay, so... Knight. Okay, I don't really... Okay, let's do defensive aura. Because we need to stay alive. Okay, so we can just, like, kill one dog. Immediately. No, we can't. Okay, so now, okay. kill the dog, you can gain an eight, ar five armor. No, we should take out the dog first. Does anybody on the field scale? Okay, that is, yeah, that's a good question. Okay, so he has two abilities, gain two power at the start of each turn. Oh, okay, so this guy scales. So we need to kill this guy quickly. You're right. That's what I should be looking out for, Brown. I should be trying to figure out who scales and who doesn't. Okay, does the dog scale? No, he just does six attack. Forever. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take out the dog. And then what's the range on this? Okay, so I need to be back like here. Let's provoke this guy so then he's only attacking my knight. All right. Okay, so here we go. We're going to go dexterity. Hold it. If I move you up here, then the wizard does extra damage. Do eight. Do eight. Nine damage. Okay, yikes. Alright. Do dexterity. Ten damage. Oh, that just kills him. Nice! Okay, we didn't lose a lot of health. I'm down with that. Okay, pick a card. Deal 11 damage. Whenever you play this card, minus one mana cost for this combat. That seems really good. Deal six damage, plus one damage this turn whenever your team gains armor. Remove targets armor and deal nine damage. Gain armor equal to armor removed. These are all really good. Um, okay, but if my time playing Hearthstone has taught me any che anything, it's that mana cheating is always good. But Siphon helps the wizard stay alive. I think actually, no, I'm going to... Throw my foreknowledge to the wind. It's unimportant. Keeping... I'm going to stick with my roguelike knowledge, which is more life means less dying. Siphon can be really powerful. Yeah, I think so too. For every 10th card playing, gain one mana and draw one card. That's really good. Okay. Okay, here we go. All right. Okay, let's just place all of them right now. Okay, deal 11 damage. Okay. Do any of these guys scale? Okay. Okay, actually, we want... All right, let's start. I'm gonna have you be up there. Wizard, amplify her powers. Gosh, just one out of range. Okay, wizard can move one farther. Fire! Okay, and then I want to get the one brawler off these other guys. And turn. Whoa! Okay, I don't know what happened there. Siphon. Okay, what's the wizard's passive? Plus one power to self. If I go... If I move you guys back, this could just be wizard turn. Deal eight damage. 
Deal nine damage. Deal eight damage. Ouch. Life is good. Trinket would have been really good with a mana cheat card. You know what? I, I actually, you're right. That would have been really good. Gain five armor. You know what I'm going to do? I'll have everybody gain armor. Wait, what? Why did I give him armor? Did I really? Oh, frick. I'm dumb. I'm, oh my gosh. Okay. You get 10 damage, 8 damage. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what I did there. Okay. This guy seems to be able to do the most damage. I'm gonna like focus my efforts on him. Siphon. And then I'm going to do... Ouch. Oh my gosh, they're brutalizing my poor wizard. Alright, everybody gain armor. Alright. And now, yay, he's defeated. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Is that far enough for far shot? It is. Wait, what's her bonus ability? Oh, okay, so if I haven't moved, that increases her damage. Okay, that just defeats him. We're good! Okay, this run is going much better. Add a card to my deck. Deal seven damage, inflict crippled. Movement is restricted to one tile. Overextend, deal eight damage, add a wound to your draw pile. An unplayable hindrance card. Deal eight damage, inflict weak or vulnerable at random. Okay, you know what? Our wizard, that looks pretty good. Debuffs are always good. All right, what's this? An open chest sits in a clearing in the middle of the forest. Gold coins glisten from within, illuminated by the sun's rays. Other than a few loose thorny vines surrounding the chest, there doesn't seem to be any apparent danger in the vicinity. Reach in and grab some gold coins, or looks like a trap, best ignore it and leave. You know, I'm... Okay. Just, uh, just as a handful of coins is removed, vines suddenly spring out from beneath the chest covered in thorns the vaults vines... Crawl along the ground and quickly encircle the chest, trapping our champions within. Thankfully, other than a few scratches, everyone is in everyone is otherwise relatively unharmed. Alright, let's leave. Working in unison, the champions cut and slash their way out before the vines can completely entrap them. The vines slither back underground at once, as if they were never there to begin with. The chest now looks the same as before, its gold coins glistening glistering invitingly. But we know better now to leave it alone. It's another typo. It should be glistening invitingly. But that's okay. Alright, a merchant. Let's put the money to good use. Card removal for 50. Um, all champions start combat with 7 armor. Blessed armband. If the first card you play during your turn costs 2 or more mana, gain 1 mana and draw 1 card. That's pretty good. For every three cards played on a single champion in a turn, said champion... Oh, that's hard to complete. I think Armband looks good. If I buy this, I can't afford any other cards, right? Just having damage. Deal three damage twice to any target, inflict weak. Grant seven armor, knock back all adjacent units by one tile. Uh, 
I feel like wizards could play three cards in a turn. Really? He could. I guess that is true. You know what? Let's try it. But that's like if the... Hmm. That's if the game goes long. Maybe it's better just to start everyone off with armor, because the archer looks like she's about to die. You know what? I'm going to do that. Okay, this doesn't look like that bad. Okay. We want the knight out front. Archer, you're there. Wizard, you're right there. Start. Defensive aura. Um, you go in the bush. Wizard. There's nothing in range, right? Okay, let's see if anybody scales. Summon two warhounds. Grant two power and five armor to all warhounds. Okay, we need to kill the dog ASAP. Oh gosh. Okay. Far shot, deal 10 damage. Everybody's out of range. Oh, okay, this is tough. All right, what do I do here? All right, I need to get you out. I need to get you. Word one more. Wizard up for... Far shot. Hold it. Okay, wait. Can't move anymore. Um, just defend. Dexterity. Okay. This is bad. I need to get to the the dog. Okay. Yikes. Okay. Nine damage, it almost kills. Okay. You know what? Okay, here we go. Um. Okay, nice. Okay, I. She died. Awesome. What I'm gonna do? Slash. Provoke. I may we'll hide in the bushes. Like, I don't know how I'm supposed to win this. Oh wait, I still had one more. Okay, whatever. Dead. Like, what do I do? This feels ridiculous. Yeah, this doesn't feel fair. Like, I'm almost at a point where it's like, oh, maybe I refund this game on Steam. Unfair. Get two more war- how am I supposed to deal with this? Am I supposed to just do runs? Like I did my whole- okay, and then that's my turn. I'm- I'm dead.
Okay, like, what is frustrating about card games, like, can be, it's like when you reach a position where you realize, that, oh, there's nothing I could do to win. And that, that's really frustrating. Like, right now, I'm in a situation where I'm looking at the situation, and I don't know what I could have done better to win that. Like, both runs, I've come across a bad guy with a lot of health, right? And I didn't even come close to beating them. You know, so it's like, what do I do? How am I supposed to win? Am I supposed to just keep running in and dying until I can level up my army? Yeah, mathematically it just doesn't make sense. Though I think you did better that run. I think I did, but I think it's just because I got lucky. I think... My first run, I came across the 70-some health enemy earlier, and this run, I just came across them later. Like, I don't think it was anything I did. I think I just got lucky. And I know there is some luck involved in roguelikes, but not like this. All right, you know what? I'll do one more run, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure I'm gonna choose a boon, pick a card to add into your deck. Sure. Do one damage three times to any target. Um, I guess barrage seems the best. I, I s you know what I'm gonna do? I'll go the upper route. I'm hoping the blood is rest. I'm hoping that's healing. Like maybe I have a better shot. Okay, start. damage three times. Deal ten damage. Eight damage. Deal eight damage. Okay, let me just heal up everybody. Or gain some armor. Gain some dexterity. Provoke the dog away from my guys. Okay, that's fine. Do I just lose armor at the end of the turn? Is that how armor works? Okay, I don't know. like I'm gonna move the knight here take him out I'm not sure how the math exactly works on this. There we go. Defeated. Okay. Choose any two targets and swap their armor. Grant eight armor. Inflict one bleed. Gain six armor and grant half the total armor to another target. Let's do that one. Sure. Proceed. All right. Right, we're gonna start. I think you need to be up here. Wizard, go here. Knight, go there. 
Regain some armor. Indeed, 10 damage. Oh, he does extra damage because he's on the puddle. That's right. Okay. Alright, Knight, you gain 8 armor. And then we're going to provoke the far dog. Because we want the dog to attack the knight. Okay, defensive aura. Heal up everybody. Okay, here we go. Barrage. Do we want to slash the dog? Do far shot on the dog. One, two, three. Okay, that we go. that's actually a really good card from the archer. End turn. Okay, I didn't like that damage. Guess set up defensive aura. Okay, let's give these two some armor. Okay, and so we just have a frick ton of armor. Okay, I'm clearing these pretty easily. Deal eight damage if the target loses health, inflict three bleed. Let's do Puncture Plus. Proceed. All right, let's see what this event is. Wait up! A traveling merchant comes rounding at the champion. He takes a moment to collect his breath before launching into a sales pitch. I have a great deal just for you. For a small fee, I'll show you three random cards, and you get to have whichever one you please. However, you have to pick a card among the three. Let me pay the offer. Dual shot seems pretty good. Okay, I'm just gonna reject. Alright, next event. Spots a lone figure sitting in the shadows. The figure looks up as it senses company. It's a haggard looking man, gaunt and wild eyed. Trembling, he gets up and with great effort cautiously approaches. Travelers, please help pull a man out. I've been cursed. It'll make you. I will make it worth your while if you can share some of my burdens. Add a wound card to your hands. Or to your deck. Every tenth card to be played will deal double damage. Rejects his proposition. Yeah, they're just typos in this game, I've noticed. The instant the man hands over his burden, he seems a different person at once. His chunk, sunken cheeks look fuller now, and color gradually returns to his face. He even appears to have grown taller. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You have no idea how much this means to me. He bades the champions farewell and departs with a spring in his step. All right. Train, group rest, or individual heal. Actually, my group's not all that hurt. What card do I want to upgrade? Why does the man look like a bear cub? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> he did look kind of bearish. Alright, I think far shot. Is a really good card. I think I need to rely on the archer to be a bit of a tank. Okay. Okay, so here's the boss battle. Let's see what happens. All right, let's start.
Okay, defensive aura. Okay, um, dual shot. Okay, we need... The archer can't move anymore. Okay, let's try this. Deal six damage. Right, move the knight here. Flash. Right, end turn. Here we go. Yikes, I did not like that. Oh, and now she's bleeding out. Okay, I need to move the archer. I'm just out of range. Ugh, okay. Oh, this is the 10th card, so it is double damage. There we go. Okay. Give her some armor. All right, and turn. Uh, let's see what happens. Okay, helping hand plus. Okay, um... Okay, you here... Do we defensive aura? I... I think I need to deal damage there. 16 damage, okay. Probably should have done different order, but... Okay, there goes my ranger. difficult because I built this deck around my ranger. <laughs> okay, at least this dog's almost dead. At least he was almost dead. Eight damage. Eight damage. Ugh, okay. Oh, I guess the bleed must have killed him. Okay. 
What do I want to do here? Um... Okay, let me do Flash to him. Let's give the wizard extra armor because he's almost dead. You know what? I think we got to full aggro this out. Seven. I don't think the wizard's coming out of this. Uh, it seems like bleed triggers when they move. I also think for the ranger to be most effective, you have to good at, have good area control. Yeah, it definitely seems like that. And I think it, but I think it's very hard to have good area control. Like, with how everybody moves, I don't have any knockback. Okay, helping hand plus. Cloak of Preservation. At the start of the turn, create the champion with the lowest health six armor. Taking anything but the ones for night seem useless. I don't want to do. I, I don't want to do another battle. Even if a champion is defeated in battle, they will be revived with 35% of their health so long as you win the fight with the remaining champion. Oh, that's really good. However, a wound card will be permanently added to your deck each time a champion is defeated, so be careful. Okay. You can store moves on the rack. Yeah, you can, but it costs mana to do that, and I'm not sure why I'd want to do it. Cards that have zero mana have plus three power. Okay. Okay. Group rest. Everybody heal. Proceed. All right, to the boss. Oh, gosh. You're the boss. Summon two minions. Grant two power and six armor to all allies. Get two junk into your draw pile. Okay. Let's start. Um, gain eight armor. You know what? I'm going to be as defensive as possible. There we go. Enter. I'm assuming most people are going to go for my knight because he's up front. Nope. Okay, puncture plus. I gotta start taking out guys. I'm gonna provoke you. There we go. End turn. Let's see if we can win. Oh, strong. Storing defensive cards could make sense if you don't need them or for turns that you're out of range. You could bank on them for better positioning. I suppose so. I, I guess it'd be good in turns where there's I have nothing else I can do. And turn. Alrighty. Um, I'm sorry. I had to just send a quick. Deal five damage three times to any targets. Okay, so I want to take you. Just 
take you out. Crippling blow. Wow, actually, my knight is running low on health. Just armor up. Okay, puncture plus. There we go. Inflict bleed. Okay, now I need to move, guys. Move you here. She goes on the turn. Let's see what happens. That is insane. There are... armor I guess cause, like why not like I don't have a mana to spend like I I'm limited to three mana if I had more mana maybe I just killed my tank here we go end turn oh. I mean I'm dead I know it why they would make storing things cost mana. I don't really either, because look. I don't know. Like, it just doesn't seem like a good system. Yeah, and like the way the enemies scale, like, it's like I have to kill them very quickly or else I'm just dead. Yeah, nah, that's, that's the run. Like, and this is... Is there anything I could have done to have won that battle. Like, what could I have done better? Like, sure, maybe positioning with... Does it cost mana to play the card once you store it? I... I don't know. I mean, I thought it would. Just let me do one more run. Burn a card, gain mana, and draw cards equal to the mana cost of the burnt card burn after use. Okay, so these are new cards. Like here, let me just let's do one more run. Gain a random relic, but all champions get their max HP reduced by three. Three isn't going to make a big difference. Which relic did I get? At the start of turn, you can choose to burn one card to draw another. If you do so, this relic cannot be used until turn... That is a... That's pretty garbage. Okay. You try to position the high priority targets into the pond. Like, I could... I don't know... What I would... I don't know what, how, what to... Like, how I would... um. It's 
select cards to burn? I don't want to burn any cards. Okay, let me just try this. Settings. Okay, so it costs two mana to store that card. And there we go, let's just do this. End turn. Let's see what happens, okay. Okay, and let's say this turn, I don't wanna burn any cards. I... Okay, now can I just play this? Okay, so stored cards don't cost mana. So I guess I could have just a big, huge burst of damage. I can just store zero cost cards. And then I save my slash. Maybe that's how I'm supposed to play it? Hi, baby Chiro just came in. Are you going night night? Have a good night night. Mm. Ah. Come on, it's night night time. It's your bedtime. Bye bye. Did you have fun? Bye bye. <laughs> I don't want to burn any cards. Baby Churro! Yeah! I probably need a Baby Churro mode. Wizard Staff. 8 damage. 8 damage. And then what I can do... Is I'll have you gain 5 armor. Gain 5 armor, provoke that guy, and slash that guy. And turn. Okay, so maybe storing cards is how you win? And I just like you store a bunch of them and then you have a huge burst turn. Maybe I want to just store a bunch of the archer cards, get the archer in position. Store that. Slash you. Okay, let's try this. I don't want to burn any cards. Alright, 10 damage. 10 damage, okay. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna do puncture. Because bleed seems really good. Volcanic glass. Okay, that's a good one. Okay, another battle. Okay, start. I don't want to burn any cards. Just going to store you, store you, store you. And my turn. I think that's the idea. Steam still seems hard, but not as unfair. I mean, I would agree. I guess I just have to have, like, a big sort of burst turn. And damaged. Defensive aura. I'm gonna slash you. And I want to provoke you. I'll save the dexterity. End turn. Let's see what happens.
Okay. Wait, no, I don't want to burn that skip. Okay. All of these deal 10 damage. If I move the wizard here, you can do that. You can deal 10 damage to you. 10 damage to you. 10 damage to you. And slash you. End turn. So bleed does two damage for every step you take. I don't want to burn anything. Do that to you. No, I want wizard staff. Wizard staff. And then we'll just do that. Okay. Okay, so I'm having better luck storing cards. There we go. Knocked and ready. Deal 9 damage to any enemy that ends its turn within range. Seems pretty good. Let's confirm that. Proceed. Alright, I think everybody needs some R&R. &R. Start, okay. Nope. Skip. Okay, now I need to move everybody forward. Okay, end turn. Far shot. Skip. Still out of range. Defensive aura. There we go. Because she's in the puddle, she does okay extra damage. got bleed on her. Skip, I don't want to burn any cards. Shoot, okay. I can't move much with her. Oh, great, I moved... Nobody's in range. I think I'd rather just slash. Okay. And turn. Not a great place to be. I don't want to burn any cards. Kidding me, you're out of range. Okay, frick. You know what? Screw it. I want you to bleed. Kill you. I think I will. Okay, I 
think I just want to play this one. Skip. trying to take down the ranger. Okay, wizard staff, just kill the dog. Kill you. And turn. shot. Oh, wait, no. I don't want to skip. Far shot. Put that on there. Okay, end turn. I think I'll put you on the shelf, and then... Okay, I think, skip, and then what I do is I play this. Okay, just kill you, fine. Turn. Okay, this is better. Nice. Okay, Ring of Might. 96 gold, add card to my deck. Burn two cards in hand. Proceed. Okay, battle again. I don't want to burn anything, Skip. Yikes. Okay. Okay, I need to use both of these. No, I don't want to burn anything. This game is kind of neat. It actually is pretty interesting. Okay, now that I've figured out, out more. It's not that bad. Alright. I am I mean, I, I'm not going to lie. It still is a bit frustrating, but it, it's pretty cool. Okay. So do that. Armor up. Okay, that one seems really good. Okay, let's burn that guy. Okay, we want to provoke this guy into attacking the knight to keep the ranger free. that on the shelf. Let's put that on the shelf and turn. Okay, skip. Do that. Alright, we heal up. We 
wizard staff you and turn. Man, okay, that one is really good. Skip, I don't want to burn a thing. And I don't want to burn a thing. Okay, you get seven armor. Every Oh, shoot, I had one more. I'm not bleeding. There we go. I think that's a victory. Okay, nice. Yay. Okay. Blazing Blade. De deal 8 damage. If this card gets burnt, create an identical copy in the draw pile with plus 2 damage. What's thorns? Okay. I think Blazing Blade. Okay, let's do this one. Yeah, because I have the, the one burn ability. Okay, looks like a trap. We're going to leave it. I know what happens to that. Alright, everybody's at pretty low health. I'm just going to do that. Proceed. Alright, you, you, and you. Alright, let's start. I want the knight out front, then the wizard, then the archer. Maybe store up you, you, and you. And turn. Now we have something to burn. Heck yeah! Okay, this is better now that I figured out how the the saving the card works. Like you literally are paying the mana earlier. Deal eleven damage. That's a lot of range. Oh, 152. Deal damage three times. Inflict two bleed for each time. The target loses H. Oh my gosh. Crippled, that's why he's not moving very far. Alright, I'm kind of trying to do as much damage as I can. Oh, well, thank you, thank you for the wonderful confetti. anything. I'm going to skip. I am actually going to just play this card. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I haven't won the battle yet. Oh my gosh, okay, that's a lot of confetti celebration. <laughs> okay, I want to burn you. Okay. Can we get the bleed? Honestly, want that. Deal 13 damage. Flick crippled. Okay, let's 
it's on the turn. Okay, that's my last confetti for this stream. No worries, you're good, dude. <laughs> I'm dead. I don't want to burn anything. It does still seem like, even after they sort of tactic. How is right, Brownie Man? Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, and I'm dead. Pretty good showing, though. Thanks. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a... <laughs> yes, it is quite sad. All right, I'm going to do a... I'm going to do a poll... Uh, what should I do now? Essentially, ha <laughs> Yeah, it's this game does feel really hard. Like the enemies do scale so much. Like I don't know what to do. All right, question: w What what do I do now? All right, do you guys want me to keep playing more Sigil of the Magi, or I could switch to a different game? Because like, I do feel my... Like, I'm... Even though I sort of have figu figured this game out more, it still is a bit frustrating. Because, like, I don't... I, like, uh, that boss still had so much health. Like, maybe I needed to get there with more health? What game? So, I guess I do have a bunch of options. I recently reinstalled League of Legends. I've been playing that. I have Smite. Um, I could do... I guess I have Super Auto Pets... I have do whatever you want, man. After all, it's your stream. Okay, fair enough. That is certainly true. Um, man, I have a lot of different games. I'm also up for like any suggestions from chat. I have Smite. If there are any like, but if there are any like other free games that you guys know about, like that I could play, like I'm also up for trying out new games. Wait a second, I forgot to plug one thing in for my computer. Give me one second, I'll be right back.
All right, I am back. Sorry about that, and I hope that didn't affect stream quality. I realized, okay, so my Wi-Fi router is pretty far away from my computer, and so I have like a 60-foot USB, or not USB, Ethernet cable that I run out to it, but I don't have it in my house usually because I don't want to trip over it. So, yeah. Okay, so... Just one suggestion, never play Ark Survival Evolved. That game has ruined my sleeping schedule. Dang. <laughs> I've heard of that game. It's But, like, oh, is it just way too addictive? Oh, man. Let me see here. Let me look through my Steam library. Because I feel like, like... I don't know. I feel like I'm kind of good with this game, if I'm honest. Oh, I also have my Epic Game Store. You know what? Let me look. Way too addictive, man. That's okay. Let me open Epic Games. All right. Played one day, 4,000 hours later, here I am. Okay, dang. Oh, man. Here, perhaps... Here, let me... Here, I'm going to close out of the game. Because, uh, yeah, I think I'm good for Sigil of the Magi. But I want to play something else, and I want to play something you guys are excited for. Um... Okay, because, yeah, I have... Man. Okay, so I've been collecting all of the free games from Epic Game Store. And I've gotten so many. I've, like... Oh, goodness. I could play one of those. I don't know. Um... Bu -bu -bu. No, I'm just looking through. Yeah, it's just tough because I've I'm a very indecisive person. Like sometimes I will back and forth on like over oh what game should I stream right now or tomorrow night. But yeah, so it's like sometimes it's like when I want to change up a game midstream, it can be real hard for me to do. Hmm. Okay, let me check out my library. I also I have two frog detective games, which those are fun. Um, I I still haven't played those. I could play Among Us, Backpack Battles. I fall, guys. I've also been meaning to try out Eternal card game. I'm not sure if you guys have heard of it. Essentially, I have a soft spot for digital card games, and this is one I've never tried out. Could be, yeah. I was thinking of dedicating a whole stream to it, but I guess here we are. Um... Alrighty, I am going to make the call. I think I'm going to play... You know what? I've been enjoying some League of Legends in my stream time. Or not stream time, free time. And I tend to rage at it a little bit. So... Let me... Yeah. Alright, I'm going to play one game of League... Uh, maybe that and I might play one or two games and I'm going to end out stream like that. Whoa. Oh, shoot. The controller. Oh, no, there we go. There we go. How can you not play rage playing league? The only time I don't rage playing league is when I'm winning. Even if you're steamrolling, something is making you mad. Okay. That is kind of true. Yeah. Let me change the game category so i've been actually getting back a little bit into league and i've been playing a lot of like nautilus support 
And dude, it is like when he work when you can get him to work, he is lots of fun. All right, let's play some Nautilus. Window capture. Okay, let me see here, here if I can do, because I know it's gonna hop full screen. Okay, here. Okay, I know that's not full screen. Let me just hit play. You know what, I've never played ranked before. Do I want to try ranked League of Legends for the first time? Or you know what? No, I'll do a draft pick game. All right, let's confirm. All right. So I'm going to do supporter top. Okay, here we go. All right, now I am just waiting. All right, what is something fun we could do while we wait? Because this is going to take, like, two to three minutes to queue up for a game. Um, hmm. Oh, here, while I'm queuing up, here's what I'm going to do. Um, I guess stream schedule for this week. Um, I do For Wednesday, I have a collab stream in the works. It's not guaranteed... But so so I don't want to give away too much in case something happens and it falls through because um, the streamer is pretty busy. But so I do have a collab stream in the works. And so I got fingers crossed it's going to go really well. So keep your eyes peeled for, uh, for that on Wednesday. But then on Thursday, um, I'm pretty excited. There, okay. I guess here, let me, it's a little bit backstory. Let me see if I can get a second window capture. So I want to show off my Twitter for this. You know, for all the times I lost those runs, I should do an Inspirobot Twitter. Okay, yeah. Um, here, window capture. Nope, not that one. My window capture. Okay, yeah, here we go. Yeah, so this is essentially a tweet I made. I saw this game called Predecessor on um yeah, I saw it on um on Epic Games. It's gonna be free next week. Apparently it looks like a sort of sci fi version of Smite. It looked pretty fun. So I think like so I just posted this. It looks like a sci fi smite. It's free next week on Epic Games. Might stream it, could be fun. And I got a huge response, 24 likes, 10 comments. That is the most I've ever gotten on a tweet, right? I'm still a very small streamer. So getting that kind of interaction was crazy. Um, but the big part was, okay, I don't know if you guys are big in the Hearthstone world. I got Regis Kilbin. He responded to my tweet. And so this game is made by a longtime supporter of his stream. Essentially, like, I mean, that's kind of a surreal moment for me. Like, I've been watching Regis's... Hearthstone videos, oh, for years, and so to get him to respond was kind of crazy. Okay, support, I can do this. Okay, I've been learning Nautilus, I'm still going to just go with Nautilus. But yeah, just with that kind of engagement, I just kind of committed to playing that next Thursday. So it should be fun, it's going to be kind of like Smite, but not exactly, I I'm excited for it. Okay, I actually don't know enough about who is good to ban. So I've been sort of banning Renata Glass. Apparently the range supports aren't are not good. I'm just hoping my opponent picks a not ranged support. Cause then cause they like to hide behind their minions. I have absolutely no idea how to play League, so I'll try to keep up with the game. Honestly, dude, if I'm going to be real with you, I don't have much of an idea myself. I'm still very new to it all. 
But essentially, it's a lot like Smite, except um, in the jungle... Okay, so there are a couple monsters that give buffs, but most of them don't. Last hitting minions is much more important. Um, dragons give permanent buffs. That's one thing. So I can smite, right? Like if you kill the fire giant or like any of the other jungle monsters, they give a temporary support. Or, I'm sorry, a temporary buff. But if you kill the dragons, they give your team, your whole team, a permanent buff. Which sort of that's the big thing. Um, and then, yeah, there's, like, the Baron, which acts like the Fire Giant, Baron Nashor. Oh, gosh. You know what? I'm still gonna go for Nautilus. That's right, man. Explain it in smite terms, yeah. So, you have Baron Nashor, who's, like, the Fire Giant. He makes all your minions bigger and more powerful. You have... And then you also have the... Oh, shoot, what's it called? The thing that crashes into towers. And they appear on... Oh, gosh. The Rift Caller. That's it, right? It, like, crashes. You can defeat it. And then you summon, like, this bug monster. And he goes and it will crash into a opponent's tower. Um, I'm trying to think who S Nautilus is like. Okay, here we go. It's loading the game... Let me switch to, okay, game capture. Okay, League of Legends. So if I click this, okay, good, yay, it's appearing. Okay, so I'm playing as this guy. So I'm support, support tends to be on the bottom link. So I'm gonna be supporting Aphelios. So his abilities, so he has an anchor pool where he throws an anchor and that deals damage. Okay, let me just buy this quick. All right, and then pocket, Locket of the Iron Solari. That's the first item I wanna buy. Um, this one gains me shields. This one um, slows and deals damage in a radius. And this one launches something at an enemy and knocks them up in the air. 30 seconds until minions spawn. So this guy's a big tanky boy. So I need to be over here to help out. Wait here. Is he already... Here, let me... Okay, so I'm gonna place a ward there. Okay, so we're not, okay. Sometimes you want to be over here to help out the jungler, but I'm I mostly follow my the bot laners. Um, I, I follow his lead usually. Okay, yeah. Okay, so we are gonna help out. Essentially, at this point, the jungler's pretty weak and has a hard time defeating some of the monsters. So we're gonna help out the jungler defeat this first monster. I mean, I guess that happens in Smite too, right? Like, people team up to defeat monsters. Okay. okay, so yeah, now the jungler should be able to defeat the monster. Okay, so Morgana and Ash, I think. Okay, they're just poking me. Two. Need to heal. Two. Three. Okay, good. I need to get out of here. Okay, I'm gonna recall. Okay, I got an assist on that. That's sweet. Okay, so yeah. Okay, so that brief stun... Okay, that, that was... Phew, that was good. Okay, so... I think... 
they do a lot of physical damage, right? I think. Um, okay, I'm just gonna get the boots. Okay, can I see their abilities? Hmm. Oh, shoot, no, I can't. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to ping that. All right. Let's see, how is our boy doing? Okay, he's poking. Okay, they're both level level two and three. I'm still level one. I sh probably shouldn't have recalled. I should mention, I am still very new to this game. I do have a ward here. There we go. I don't... Does anybody know what this does? I think my Morgana... The, Mor the Morgana... Causing that. Okay, the thing is, I can't get too close or else the tower is gonna... Do damage. It's an enemy. Okay, we escaped from that... Pretty unscathed. I'll give him a thumbs up too. Okay, there we go. Okay, I think I want the magic resistant boost. Okay, that was really good, but dang, that took a lot out of me. Okay, the Morgana's recalling too, so yeah, the, the lane should be fine. Okay, here we go. Um, I want Mercury's Threads. Okay, if I... Mm, okay, I'm gonna get the... Th yeah. Okay, cool. Let's get back to lane. Um, you know what? Sure. Fake. Uh oh. Okay, I can't move any faster. An okay. Has been slain. Okay, nope. I'm gonna get out of the jungle. I'm actually doing really well this game. Two assists. Yes! Okay, that's... I'm sorry, that's such a good feeling. Oh, okay, yes. Okay, I'm sorry. Whew. Okay, this is why, like, MOBAs are so exciting. Like, why I really like things like Smite. And, and, and ally has been Heroes of the Storm. I 
it's just dang it gets, it's such a rush when you can actually like pull off that kill oh okay yeah I'm sorry Upgrade my anchor throw. Okay, hold on. I'm. Do we have this area warded? Okay, now we do. I probably should try out Dota 2 sometime. Okay. Shoot, 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 shoot. I'm running, running. No, okay. I got greedy. Okay. That's okay. Lock it to the Iron Solari. Let me make some progress with that. Yeah. I think, feel like that character is really like Sylvanas from Smite. Yeah, he really is. Okay, good. We got the... Oh, that's it. Not Rift Caller. Rift Herald. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to likely do damage to a tower, which should be really good. But yeah, he is in a lot of ways, except he also gets pulled towards the target. He doesn't pull the target exactly toward... directly towards him. But yeah, it is a pretty... It's a pretty similar comparison. Yes. Okay, we couldn't kill the other guy. But yeah, in a lot of ways, he is similar to Sylvanas. If Sylvanas, like, was able to get me a little tankier... Because he has, um... In a lot of ways, he's kind of like Bacchus. He has a lot of, like, slows and he stuns briefly with some of his abilities too with the grab and root yeah that in that way he is like yeah he is like Sylvana I guess one big difference between this and Smite. Oh, mm, I almost got away. Okay, that was really close. Okay, let's get this. Extra armor and ability haste. One way this is, yeah, it's like lasting minions is a big deal. Because that's how you get the most golden experience. Is if you, yeah, do the last hit. Mm, if we had a vision of that area, I probably would have. Mm. Oh, probably would have been able to do better. Oh, well. My partner is a tanky bumblebee.
An enemy has been slain. Double kill. An ally has Destroyed been the enemy slain. ward. Shut down. I'll go for it. But only if there's somebody else there. Like, I can't solo the big Turret cloud drake by myself. Okay, here we go. Okay, I held them off my friend. Uh, but alas, he was able to take me. That's okay. That's that's what um, being a support is all about. Knowing how to knowing how to peel. All the ward can see is each other, or is it like smite where they're special? So essentially, there are certain ability. Yeah. I don't, so some, yeah, that, that's exactly how I would put it. Some wards can see other wards. An enemy has been slain. And so because I placed my one ward there, it spotted the other ward. Your team has destroyed but most of the time, it's just other players. Okay, here, let me put, I need to drop ward here. She at least got damage. Wonder if she can see me. Is he asking for vision? Oh, yeah, that's right. Destroy this turret. An ally has been slain. An ally has been I didn't have an answer. <laughs> okay. Grant shield. We're gonna do this. 20 armor, 250 extra mana, 10 ability haste. Your turret has been destroyed. Oh man. Three flags. I'm not sure if you're still in chat, but who did you main in League? Who was someone you really liked playing as? I'm going to set up a ward up here. Oh, 
I've never played League. You were just memeing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fair enough. No. Killing spree. I will say, people do get angry on League. Like, I've had people tell me to quit, like, uninstall the game and quit because I have played so badly. Wait, wait. He's going backwards. Oh gosh, what are we doing? It happens. Yeah, it does. Especially in MOBAs, I feel. But, you know. Okay, did I get... I, hopefully I got an assist on that one. Did I? Or I guess I didn't attack Ash. Okay, actually, I will say one thing. Just talking about toxicity in games, real talk. Like, the Smite community has actually been really wholesome, I feel, on my channel. And, like, when asking questions on Reddit. Oh, are they going for Baron? Okay, I think we going for Baron. Essentially, like, different games, I've gotten definitely mean comments. Like, especially Hearthstone. Who? And, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! too. But with Smite, like, I've gotten people who will... An ally has been slain. I got people who will AFK in a game. But I've never gotten anybody who... Yeah, but I've never actually gotten someone, like, who is, like, really mean on my channel. Like, I feel like people who like the game... Okay, yes! Okay, we got... Real toxicity? Yes. Pretty sure that's how it's spelled. Um, I, I made the mistake of thinking I could take him. Oh, Avelio shut him down. Yay. Oh, that's really good. One game it's like I lost because of my team was pretty bad, then one of my team DM'd me. How did I lose that game so bad we were after playing together tank? <laughs> That's funny. That's awesome though. Like I've seen just Shut down. a handful of like toxic people. Like or not toxic, but for the most part, the Smite community's really wholesome. Which that's I, I really love that. Like that's uncommon in a whole. Okay, good. We've slayed the Chemtrek Drake. So that gives our whole team a buff. Are we going Baron or are we not? Okay. Probably not is the answer.
Okay. Yikes. Okay. Um, yeah, Thorn Mail seems really good. I want to go... I need to start using the locket more. When I get into a big battle, I need to press three. Um... On health or armor? I think working towards Bramble best is, best is the best idea. Your turret has been destroyed. All right, let me go help out Victor. My, the enemy is probably gonna get Baron. Hit. Oh no, I shouldn't be alone. I'm gonna tag up with the rest of my team. Yeah, because if I'm alone, I can die really easily. For Baron? Wait, where's a? F oh, goodness. Did he go off by himself? Phileos. Your turret has been destroyed. Okay, I'm going down to help Vi. There's just nothing I can do. Dang, yep, yeah, that's that's game. Oh. Alright, is Aphelios getting away? Dang. Wow. Yeah, I'll give him a surrender on that. Yeah, everyone agreed to surrender. Dang, that was rough. Ugh. I mean, at that point, they were going to get a big snowball -y lead. I feel like I did pretty well, though. What an ambush. Yeah, that was really rough. You know what? I will make this big screen. There we go. Honor and a teammate. Aphelios, you're pretty good. C+, plus, I did better than that. All right, I want to play one more game. That was fun. Woo! All right, that was good. Alrighty. All right, you know what I'm going to do? Because I don't have... All right, let's go to... Okay, wait, that's the League of Legends client. America, yeah, heck yeah. All right, here we go. All right, so sometimes after a loss in a game, 
I will post an Inspirabot motivational quote to my Twitter of chats choosing. So this is an AI generated motivational quote. Um, we have some time to kill. Might as well do that. You know, because what can happen is often times a defeat can be very demoralizing and you, you don't want that sticking on your soul. So having some inspiration can be really uplifting and inspire you to move forward in the game. All right. First quote, once unique, always unique. I don't think that's true, but we're going to go with it. All right. Quote number two, expect public ridicule, prepare for moral. That doesn't make sense. All right. That's quote number two. Number three, marriage is just like being high, a curse, and has men with speedos on it. Okay, that's quote number three. These are some really weird ones tonight. Show hate, dream big. <laughs> that's quote number four. That's such a dumb one. All right, number five. If you think about procrastination, you cannot think about monsters. Okay, this is quote number five. I think this one's my favorite, but I'm going to let Twitch chat choose which one they want new poll one two three four five all right you've got one minute to pick which quote you want me to tweet out all right i'm gonna go through it again quote number one once unique always unique quote number two okay there, yeah this is quote number two brownie man Expect public expect public ridicule. Prepare for moral, which that doesn't make sense. That's it should be a noun, not an adjective. Okay, marriage is just like being high, a curse. All right, that's number three. Number four, show hate, dream big, and lastly, number five. If you think about procrastination, you cannot think about monsters. Oh, I found him. All right, I'm going to take a look at the poll. Ooh, it's split 50-50 between 5 and 3. Okay, here. I'm just going to pick Nautilus. 3, 4, and 5. All, okay, all tied. All right, uh, what I'm going to do is I really like number five, so I think I will be the tiebreaker, and I'm going to pick that one. Oh, wait, shoot. Um, Here, one second. Glask. Yeah, I'm just going to ban her. There we go. I won't hold my breath. Okay. Here we go. Okay, cool. Yay. Man, I feel uplifted and inspired. Three is hilarious, but you are married. So, yeah. Yeah, that was kind of why I was thinking, oh, maybe I, I'm not sure how true a wife would feel about that one. Say, oh, yes, love is a curse. <laughs> Or marriage is a curse. I don't think so. she would like that one. You voted for three. Honestly, three was a funny one. And the guys in Speedos jumping off a bridge kind of made it funnier. Yeah, but I, dang. I just think about like the, oh, you can't think about monsters if you're thinking about. Wait, I'm top? Oh, shoot. No, I shouldn't be him. I need to be Yorick. Yorick's my top main. Okay, um... Okay, I actually don't play top a lot, but I, okay, um. Why play? Okay. Okay, I'm playing against a Garen. Okay, so that is... Oh, come on. I want the healing. All right, I think that's good enough. All right.
Game capture. Okay, there we go. Game capture is now picking it up. I didn't know you were married, Lamal. Hey, no worries. Actually, I do have one emote in chat of a little avatar I made with my wife. There she is. Little churro wife. Yay. <sighs> Man, I actually have to remember how to play Yorick. I have not played Yorick in a while. Yay, Churro Wife. Yeah, we love Churro Wife. Okay, matchup. Combo. Attack into a queue before spamming away with attacks. And of course, if Maiden's already out, this will deal far more damage. For matchups, Yorick does very well into low mobility. Okay. Boons take this. Conqueror just goes great with his kit. For build orders, start Shield and Pot into Tier 2 Boots and Divine Sunderer. After this, get Hullbreaker into Serodas. Okay, okay, cool, cool. All right. There is a series on YouTube where it's like three minute League of Legends guides. It tells you how to play a character in three minutes. Super good. Honestly, if someone did that for Smite, like, that would be awesome, too. Yay, Jero Wife. Yay. Yeah, she's 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 great. And it's an awesome. It's a, it's a cool little emote. I like having her. <laughs> yeah. You could not do that for any Yu-Gi-Oh deck, lol. Yeah, that is really true. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh takes a lot of time to learn a deck. Except for some, there are some simpler ones out there. Like, there's the one Apocalypse Ritual Summon deck I like. And that one you can... It's just like a... There, there are like a th three or four different ways to pull off that combo. It's not bad. I actually want to play Yu-Gi-Oh again. I think I'm. I, I've been thinking about getting back into it. I have had. Um, oh gosh, that deck is clunky as heck, dude. It yeah, you're right. It is very clunky. But when it works, like when you can bring out the big apocalypse guy, and it just you you sacrifice two thousand life to c entirely clear everything else on the board. It's it's pretty good. I mean. At least I feel it is. Like, anything your opponent has, gone. There's a Spanish guy that I follow that explains the skills and combos and kit and rolls of some of the gods in Smite. Oh, really? Hey, you should drop a link to it in chat. I think I have links enabled. I'm actually... Okay, so, to practice my Spanish, I've been listening to Spanish Hearthstone YouTubers. Um... I think it's helping. I don't know. But yeah, I would definitely be up for it. Like, up for listening to it. Because, like, um, like that is a big part of, like, growing your knowledge. Like, in your skill in learning a language. It's just, you know, taking in content. But he doesn't do them often. That's okay. Like, I'd go through his back catalog. I think he has like 10 or so. That's, that's still a pretty good number. But yeah, I do get what you're saying. Like it is. Yeah. And honestly, okay, I will say this. On my side as a streamer, like I make, it, it takes a lot of effort to make a YouTube video. Even when I'm, what I'm doing, I'm doing like simple, easy peasy. Like um, I just take the stream and I cut it down into little videos. That's it. Okay, you played it. Okay. But like, um, what was I saying? Yeah, I just cut it down into like little videos. Like, and that still takes a ton of time. Welcome to Summoners. Not much, but helps. Yeah, my friend's brother learned Japanese through anime and stuff, and he took. <laughs> you, you have good Japanese, but quit watching anime through Yakuza movies. You sound like a criminal. Dude, that sounds so awesome. I want to sound like a criminal. Okay, so I ward here. Even though I just watch his duels videos to learn how to play a god. No, that's fair. Yeah, I, I check him out. Like, um. Okay, and here, before we get too far into this game, I should tell you guys. 
how Yorick works. Minions have spawned. Essentially, so he's a solo laner, which in League of Legends is the top lane. Top lane's a solo lane. He has his shovel, which heals him when it deals damage. And he's also got, um, he has a wall ability. He launches some mist, and he can summon sort of an evil, like a, a spirit of the dead. To vote to remake the game because of... Wait, how does that, how do we do that? Okay. Okay, yeah, because a player is AFK. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So what he does, though, is when so many minions die around him, he is able to summon... Okay, just gotta see. I'm fine with that. Play again. Okay, find match. Alright, well, this starts over again. Actually, that's kind of sad. I was really looking forward to that game. Because I, um, being matched up against Garen's a pretty good matchup for Yorick. I feel my, myself like someone that learns best with watching someone do it. Yeah, that is true. I, I feel like I learn really well. Like, I'll watch somebody do it, but then I have to do it a bunch of times to actually get good at it. You know, like, that's sort of how I feel. Warchawar. Okay, here, let me... Let me find him on YouTube, and I will get... I'll, I'll give a sub to him. Okay, yeah, there you go. Subscribed. Cool. Oh, something. Um, YouTube's... You know how... Okay, so here's something weird I, I wanted to also talk about. You know how YouTube like, has gotten their new ad blocker program? And it's really annoying. People hate it. Then there's Addicts. He's an English YouTuber. Best solo laner in the game. I think I've heard of him before. Let me look him up. But essentially, I can't... Like... Okay... On my normal account, I can't watch anything. Okay, I just subscribed to him. Yeah. I'll be sure to give his stuff a watch. Maybe that'll help me learn stuff better. Like, I can't watch stuff on my, like, personal account that I have for my personal email. But with my um, account for content creation, I can watch things no problem with my ad blocker. Oh, shoot, yeah. Let me... I don't know. I just think that's interesting. <laughs> um, yeah. Let me think. What else can we talk about while this is all happening? Oh, you guys heard that Peter Griffin's being added to Fortnite. That's, that's big news. Which I think is funny. <laughs> like, I'm not a big Fortnite guy. We have the perfect learning smite YouTuber. Let me find him. Hey, you know, definitely do that. I'd love to see. I actually, probably after the stream, I will be working on editing another video. It'll probably be a smite one. Probably me doing some joust. Like, either me doing joust or me doing... The oh shoot, I forget what it's called, but the A RAM mode, all random, all middle. Daxon is the name. Got it. Man, it's actually taking. 
Dax on. Actually, it's taking a long time to queue up. And it's in English? Nice. All right. I'm subbed. Cool. I'm curious to see what it's like. What they're like. Yeah. I'll check them all out. So I can understand him. Hey, if he was in Spanish... I could understand him a little bit. Like, like a little bit. Like, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not... My Spanish is not great, but... I could understand some of what he says. Probably need to practice my Spanish more. But... Okay, wow, it is taking a long time to queue up for this game. Oh, there we go, match found, finally. Yeah, sometimes it takes a long time to queue up for a league game. Okay, so I'm back on support. So I'm going to go be Nautilus again. Nautilus is my man, my jam. Nautilus, I am a fan. Anybody else want bot lane? Oh, goodness. Okay, we'll go Nautilus support. I was not ignite. Ignite is ignite the one. Okay. I don't know what this person in chat is meeting. Good thing he's not French. Yeah, I guess so. Anything counting above like 50, man, I would be confused. Ooh. Let's do this, not. Hell yeah. <laughs> Nautilus and Samira is insane. Oh, okay, so I'm Oh, Samira. I remember Samira. I've played her ADC in the hot minute. I gotta say, no worries. <laughs> okay, I don't know. I'm gonna just stay out of conversation. I don't know what people are saying. All right, well, good thing I have this censored out. Should I just preemptively mute the chat?
All right, let's do this. Let's find this out. All right. So I'm going to be with Samir. I actually don't know anything. That is one thing I that's hard with this game. I guess it is like that in all MOBAs. But, like, I have no idea what my, like, what my amigos do. Okay, so I'm going to take... Oh, and technically you shouldn't lock the camera, but I can't figure out how to play without locking the camera. It's just too zoomed in. Actually, what I am going to do... 30 seconds until minions spawn. While I have the speed, okay. Because usually they'll come up the river. Probably a good idea. Honestly, yeah, okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm just gonna... Yeah, let's just mute the chat. Minions have spawned. Alrighty. Here we go, jungle monsters. Cool, so now he's an attack buff. Gets a temporary one. No, shoot, shoot, shoot. That was the wrong button. Shoot. Dang it, I, I got way too aggressive there. Double kill. Yep, I'm glad I'm muted. Oh, uh, yeah, let's just run. I... Oh, what was I thinking? Uh, okay. That, that was bad. That, that was a bad move. Oh, I got so greedy, I wanted that kill. Ah. Uh. An enemy has been slain. I should have been happy with forcing a recall. Uh, I should have just left. Killing spree. Shut down. Stay around. Okay, we need a kill. Is that our Warwick? Okay.
Okay, good. At least I got an assist on that. Okay, retreat. All right. Hello, you're back. Your phone died. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, but welcome back. Good to have you back, old Waka. Okay. I think... I want... the mercury threads. Alright, is he going for the Chemtech Drake? Okay, good. He got it. Moon's panel. What are we talking about? Not really much of anything, honestly. But yeah, um, I got too aggressive and I died. Oh, those guys from YouTube. Yeah, we were talking about them. Yes! Okay. That was good. Daxon will be the best to learn than Haddix, the best one to approve, and War Cheese to practice my Spanish. Oh, heck yeah. right here I don't want to get too risky around this guy Samira coming okay okay and no I definitely will check all of those guys out Yes! Oh my gosh, we're on fire. Okay, I probably really should recall though. I need to get some good gear. You know what? Dang, I got greedy. That's okay. By the boots. There we go. All right. All right, we defeated the Rift Herald at least. How am I doing in mid lane? Or okay, because my guy can also move between bot lane and mid. Samira is at six. He's at six and seven. Okay, we're a little bit behind. How are they doing in mid? He's at eight. Okay, they're all at eight. I think I'm gonna stick with Fox. Oh, I got stunned.
Okay. Shut down. Yes! Oh, that was awesome. Okay, I shouldn't have used my ultimate on him. Just remember to take breaks and not just focusing on learning and getting better, but to play having fun. I think that is the most important part to remember. Especially with these sort of MOBA games, yeah. Because they can get really competitive. And people can get really heated on them. So yeah, you're right. Just keeping that in mind. Making sure having fun is the most important thing. I'm dead. Yeah, I don't think there's anything I can do about that. What are these bees? Who's summoning bees? Okay, one kill, three assists. Or, sorry, yeah, one kill, three deaths, six assists. I think I'm in a good place, especially as a support. Oh, heck yeah, let's take that. An ally has been oh, no. slain. Come on, kill him, kill him. Okay, good, yay. My death was not in vain. Okay. Oh, I got two assists from that. Nice. Okay, awesome. I think I'm gonna go for Thorn Mail next. Thorn Mail is just generally good. Oh. Okay, so this is gonna be useful for keeping my friends alive. Whoa, Krakatoa! Heck yeah! Stuck. Okay. Okay, I forgot that. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, it's pretty cool. It does like a cool volcanic eruption. Oh, also, those guys are GM players, so they're tryhards, especially. Uh, they can be useful. You can learn a lot from tryhards. Honestly, though. Your turret has been destroyed. But I think, depending on the game, sometimes it can be too much. Too much information. Or it'll be like, hey, I'm just trying to chill and have fun. Are you actually trying to teach me things? Boy. Okay, I'm gonna head back to mid. Okay. Your team has destroyed. Ooh, vine, yes. Yeah, 
Yeah, okay. Actually, the vines look pretty cozy, not gonna lie. Hey, glad you like them. Yeah, I think they're pretty fun. Like, I just, I was trying to do, like, different variety with, like, effects. Rampage. Ah. Okay, I don't think there was escaping that. I mean, outside of not being aggressive and leaving, leaving sooner. It gives like a jungle look? Yeah, that's kind of what I was going for. Just because I'm sort of like adventure, exploration, jungle theme. I thought it was sort of very fitting. One kill, six assists, ten deaths. That's pretty good, I think, right? What, what KDA does that give me? An enemy has been slain. Like, I am a support. We should be real here. I'm not going to be landing a lot of the kills. Double kill. Like, I can land occasional kills. Triple kill. Awesome. I'm hoping someone got the eye of the Rift Herald. They killed most of our team. Did we get the chance to use the Eye of the Herald? Wait, I have the Eye of the Herald? Your turret has been destroyed. I didn't realize I had that. Okay. Shut down. I don't know. I hear if we get enough surrender votes, I will vote surrender. I vote surrender. Double kill. Yeah. An ally has been slain. <laughs> Perfect timing, yeah. Oh man. Okay, yeah, no, we're not doing well this game. Oh, we should surrender. I need to get up some I need to get up to top lane. And just release the dang Rift Herald. Because, yeah. Do I stick with the group? I don't have a lot of time on the Rift Herald left. You've almost gotten barren.
This is not ideal, but I'm going for it. An ally has been slain. I didn't want to go to waste. Maybe it's not the best move, but nah, I don't know. I think at this point in the game, we are not in a great position. Let's just say that. Shut down. Okay, we got Yasuo. Enemy killing spree. the only one on my team to go in on that and that it's not a good idea oh uh, yeah very appropriate I, I deserve that your turret has been destroyed I'm going bot here. An ally has been slain. An ally has been slain. There are two of them down here. Well, our allies just keep getting slain, I think. Okay, yay, I got him. Okay, that was pretty good. I do think we should still surrender, though. Oh, well, thank you, thank you. Yes, it was quite the fun. Nothing I can do. Enemy quadra kill. Shut down. Two to two, dang. I I'm just surprised we can't get a surrender vote. Like, they just keep destroying our team. Your turret has been destroyed. That's right here. He always turns into Mega Nar. An ally has been slain. Seems to be our team's theme song. Man, okay, I will be very surprised. I think it's doable for us to turn it around. It's not super likely, but it's possible. An enemy has been slain. I mean, there's nothing I could do. I guess I could have flashed. Maybe that was something I could do. Oh, 
Um. I guess at least Warwick got away. Alright, let's get let's watch some of the rest of the action. An enemy is legendary. Uh an enemy has been slain. Two kills, eleven deaths, eleven assists. This is, okay, this is not a good record. Has been slain. Oh gosh, nope. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna Great. Now there are two of them. There's nothing I can do. Your inhibitor has been destroyed. You're pinging the Baron. Man, all right. I think we just need one more vote, and that's a surrender. Man, are we really not going to surrender? Man, it always does surprise me. Like, I feel like we definitely should surrender right now. Enemy rampage. And that is the end. Dang. Defeat. Alrighty. Well. Okay. Over two.
Um, you know what? Samira was friendly. I'll give it to her. Ooh, I got a champion capsule. It's a GG. Yeah, I suppose it was. Alright, let's open this champion capsule, and I think I will end the stream. Twitch champion shard, huh? Garen champion shard and blue essence. Cool. Alright, I think I am going to end the stream here. Sweet. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. It's been loads of fun. I've enjoyed having you guys here. I think I'm going to call it a night. Let me see who is live right now and so I can send them all over to them for a raid. Um, see who's live right now. And if there are any suggestions from chat, I am always up for a good suggestion. Night. Hey, you have a good night too, Awaka. Alright, what's Hal streaming? Alright, Hal's streaming right now. Maybe I'll send you guys on over to him for a raid. channel Alcyon the Halcyon Alright, let's start this raid Cool, I'm gonna send John over to Hal I think he's just chatting right now, but he's a good streamer, and uh, he does good content Alrighty Well, I hope you all have a great night um, I should be back on Wednesday, hopefully with collab stream, could be fun um, And then I will be on Thursday as well. I'm going to be trying that predecessor game out. Looks a lot like Smite. Should be loads of fun. Alrighty, well, I hope you all have a great night, and I will see you all around. Bye for now.